would agree. Having found as we have that the bail terms did not remove the appellant from office, but merely required compliance with the constitutionality sanctioned terms that of necessity limited his access to the county offices until determination of the trial, we find that the learned judge sufficiently addressed the issues of pointing out the relevant constitution, constitutional, constitutionally crafted remedy. All issues considered, we are satisfied that the learned judge determined and analyzed only matters that were placed before her. And as we have found, no misdirection in the exercise of discretion, we have no basis upon which to interfere with the High Court's decision. In sum, the appeal is unmerited and is for dismissal with costs to the respondent. It is so ordered. We respectively agree with the learned judge's holding, and we have no basis of faulting her in any way. In conclusion, therefore, we find this appeal devoid of merit and dismiss it in its entirety. The appellant shall bear the costs of the appeal. It is so ordered.